Welcome back to our Jamon here. This is Killer G here. And to review the Super Mario Wonder. For Nintendo Switch. Yeah, for Nintendo Switch. Yeah. I, yeah, so Super Mario Brothers Wonder, I say it's a really good game. The co op is fun. Or only play locally if you have friends. Yeah, like, never put the online co op. The online multiplayer fucking sucks. Damn. Yeah, it looks like you're fucking so Yeah, I'm like, 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 freaking 3D World didn't have that shit, like, why not just make the online multiplayer, like, freaking 3D World, huh? Yeah. I'll get like, that feature. 3D World, like, 3D World was normal, it looked fucking normal. Yeah, exactly, it looked normal, 3D World. So I don't know what the thing is with these freaking ghosts and shit. I don't get it either. Yo. Yeah, they can also... You know, like, like they can make it like Treasure Revenge, even where the ca the players can just drop in. True. But the gameplay is good in this game because you play as the elephant. Yeah, the elephant power up is really good, dude. Yeah, there. Yeah, so the power ups there is the mushroom, fire flower, and superstar, of course. But there's new power ups like the elephant fruit. Which turns you into an el which turns you into an elephant. You also got the bubble flower, which makes your player shoot bubbles. It's basically like the baby, the blue Yoshi from New Super Mario Brothers U, but you don't have to carry him around or anything. No. And also, the bubble flower. Actually, a fun fact about the bubble flower is that it started off as a fan-made power-up in a fan-made Mario game. It was a Super Mario World ROM hack. Nice. Yeah, and we also got a technically returning power up, it's the drill, the drill mushroom. But yeah, oh yeah, like I say, it's a returning power because we had it in Galaxy Two, but it's, 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 you can burrow underground like in Galaxy Two, but it's much different now since you can bur you can go underground for much longer. And you hold the button, you go underground. You know, the drill power up is a fun one as well. Uh huh. Yeah, but my favorite, I honestly, though, I prefer the bubble flower over the elephant fruit. Yeah. Yeah, because it's fun to use. You shoot bubbles to, yeah, to make platforms to bounce. You can use bubbles as platforms, yeah. Yeah. You, know, you can also shoot, you can also put projectiles in bubbles and stuff, like fire, the hair brothers and stuff. Did you like the alpha power, oh. Angelo? What? Did you like the alpha power when you and Fiesel were playing? What power up? The elephant one. Yeah, we used it. Yeah, yeah. And the one there's one thing that we forgot to talk about, and that is the playable characters. So we, so we got Mario, we got Luigi, we got Peach, and the, for the first time ever in the mainline Mario games, Daisy. Yeah, we also got Blue Toad and Yellow Toad from the new Super Mario Brothers games. Toadette. We got yo. We got green Yoshi, red Yoshi, blue yo, light blue Yoshi, and yellow Yoshi. We also got Nabbit. Nice. Yeah. So, yeah. Mario, Luigi, Peach, Daisy, and the Toads. There, all of them play the same. There, but the Yoshis, they have their flutter jump and they can eat projectiles and stuff. But they they can't use power ups. So. Like, Yoshi can't use the elephant fruit or the bubble flower. No. Although it would be cool, though, if they, if they could. Like, imagine Yoshi has a, has an elephant. Yes. Yeah, look, it probably looks strange, huh? Oh, the yeah. Elephant. <laughs> yeah, but the, I do like the... But one, one complaint I say about the game is that they reused Bowser Jr. as a boss fight too much. Yeah. I know. Like four or five times, like... The, the multiplayer, man, they better fix that, man. That's a major issue. I know. Like, local multiplayer is fun. Like, me and D'Angelo, we beat the game together, huh? Yeah. And 
Like well, the logo well, multiplayer is it okay. Matter. It doesn't matter. Like, why can't it just be all, like that? Online multiplayer is supposed to run perfect. That's the standard. They should they shouldn't have a problem with the character looking like a ghost and all of that. And not even be able it's like we don't can't even interact with them when we're in the game. I know. Because he ends up running past us when uh, we have control of the screen. Yeah. So it's like he's not even in the multiplayer game. Yeah, like everyone's saying for some stupid reason that it's actually good. Well no. the multiplayer is fucking shitty. Well what is bad here. Yeah, the uh, multiplayer uh, is fucking Horrible! Terrible like ass. Say, you know? It's fucking horrible. I know. Friggin' you, Halo has better multiplayer than this shit. Yeah. Yeah, they, they should just help, They should release a free update that fixes this fucking thing. I know. The... Hopefully Nintendo sees this fucking video... And they get their shit together and change the multiplayer up. Yes, Nintendo. Actually, may yeah, like have the option to have classic multiplayer. Classic online multiplayer. Some people, and there's also some people that want to see a hard mode in Mario Wonder that adds a time limit. Mm -hmm. Yeah, what do you think of that idea, huh, Killer J? Be interesting. Yeah, it'd be cool as an option. You know? Yeah. yeah. But I kind of like how they don't force it on you in the wonder, though. Yeah. Time thing. Yeah, but, yeah, another thing is that with all the 2D Mario games, like, I'd say my favorite one is still Mario 3. Yeah, they should definitely have the timer feature, though, as an option because some people like that. Yeah, it's cl it's like a classic thing in the games, yeah, like... Have a have a option for like a classic mode or whatever, a killer J. True, who's gonna have to add that in? They should have added it in on launch D. Yeah. Yeah, they get added as a free update though if it sometime down the line. Yeah, it's true, they can do that. Yeah. If for my reading on this game, I wouldn't get a high score due to the multiplayer kinda of turn me off. I give it me yeah. like Oh, what would you rate it, to be honest? Yeah. I'd, I'd, what do you say, D'Angelo? 7 out of 10. Yeah. It's pretty, it's, it's a really good game, but they gotta fix those features before I can say it's a 10 out of 10. I'm gonna go with a 9 out of 10 for this one. I'll go for it. I'll go for a 7 out of 10. I go for seven because they gotta fix those features before. Uh, and if they fix those features, it would be straight up ten out of ten. At least it'd be yeah, it'll, exactly. it'll go up a couple points for me too. Yeah. Fix that online feature. That's the main thing. That's yeah. Making me rate it seven out of ten. They have it actually like the local multiplayer. Yes. Yeah, and, and if they can give you the all. Like I would rate it if it had that fix. I would rate it nine out of ten. And if they have it, like, where you can set the timer and stuff, and that's optional, then it'd be straight 10 out of 10, I'd say. There you go. Mm -hmm. So that's good. be perfect, because if you had that option, that's what, like, makes it so, like, it's a challenge to get through it as quick as possible. Yeah. But there's also, like, you'd like to explore the map and not have a timer, it's so good to have that option as well. Yeah. Indeed. So let's kill a J here. Phase on God 420 and the Angel Pitcher. And we're and phasing I, uh, out. Phasing out. Peace enough. Phasing out this one.